Hello everybody, this is 10 Days of Darkness. How are y'all doing today? This is breaking news, breaking news. Um, Israel has wrote a report, or sound a report, saying that Russia is most likely to attack any moment. Um, Next, this is found on Texas News Network. Uh, there's 150,000 troops amassed on the Ukraine-Russia border with another 30,000 um, in Belarus. Um, another part of the report is they're moving 10 battle groups into an area where there's 100 other battle groups. They're ready to strike. Them withdrawing was not withdrawing, it was a trick. They're about to attack. Um, said lim- they're going to do a limited attack. I don't know. That's what it said on before. And Nick's new, um, text news network, but it's still going to be bad, everybody. Um, this is crazy. They got like almost 200,000 troops on the border of Ukraine and ready to attack. I'm worried that they're going to do something like this and then they're going to. Then we're going to attack them back, and they're going to attack, and it's going to turn into a big nuclear war, and it's going to kill the whole planet. All you naysayers out there in Reddit land who doesn't think this can happen, it can happen real quick. Watch the sum of all fears. A lot of times Hollywood has to tell us what's going to happen before the elite and the deep state do it. And the sum of all fears, it was like 10 years ago came out, I think, or 12 years ago, somewhere around there. But it's a very, very realistic movie where... A terrorist group was trying to pit Russia and the United States together to for a war. So you guys got to watch that. Some of all fears. Get out your Netflix. Get out your phone. Watch that today. Watch that right now. Um, Russia is about to attack. It may be limited, but they're still about to invade Ukraine Um, at any moment. But this is, I'll be back as soon as I find out more information. A lot of stuff's going on today. I will be back. Never give up, never give in, never surrender, never take up the rose lever. God bless you all.